Hi guys, Foxtrot here. Quick tutorial today on how to install third party content for free off flightsim.to for Microsoft Flight Sim 2020. First thing you want to do is get yourself to flightsim.to okay, and create yourself an account. Once you're there, uh, you've got the main page here. The list will have new uploads and trending right now. Um, but I know exactly what I want today. I want the RAF livery for the Project Mega Pack A330 aircraft. Okay, so all I'm going to do is on the left hand side where the categories are, I'm just going to click on aircraft. I'm then going to go to Airbus PMP Airbus A330. And there's my file here. Basically, this, will, this is where all the uh, files for that particular aircraft will come up, or it might be scenery if you're looking on this left hand side as well. Okay, but I'm after the livery today. But Basically, as you scroll down, you can see different pages. Uh, it'll also give you the chance to uh, search alphabetically, or most liked, or most downloaded. Okay, but I'm going to click on this one here. This will then take you to the actual upload page. Okay, and on here again, you can get more information. You have the rating, you have information from the uh, creator, and then further down, you have comments from other people as well. Okay, all you do is you click this big green download button, and that will take you to another page. Okay, and here you'll see a countdown timer to when your uh, page will down, your file will download. Once that's downloaded, it will come in the left-hand side here. Okay, that can take up to a few minutes depending on the size of the files. There are some big files on here, so give it time to work and make sure it's fully downloaded before you exit this page. Okay, now that's done, I can exit the internet. Okay, next I'm going to go to the download section. Okay, this is obviously where my downloads go. And there's the file there that I've just downloaded. You also need the community folder open because this is where you're going to put this folder. Okay, but importantly, what you need to know is pretty much all of the time they will come as zip folders. Okay, and when they do, that means you need to extract them. Okay, if they're like this with a yellow zip folder, you can just do it here by right clicking and click extract. Okay, if they're in a different format, you may need a piece of software to extract them. Okay, but this one I can literally just right click and click extract. Okay, that will then say it's going to extract it to the downloads folder. That's where I want to put it for now. And that's going to go into the folder there. Okay, you can see it's made a duplicate folder exactly the same. Okay, this time it's not got the zip on there. This is the folder you want, guys. Okay, that's important. Do not drag this folder over. Okay, what you then need to do is you need to double check that uh, it hasn't created another folder inside, which it does quite a lot if you do it this way. Okay, so if I double click that, I can see there there's another folder inside okay so this is the folder I need and the way I know that is because I click it again and you can then see the JSON files here all right if you've gone to this bit you've gone too far and you need to go back one okay so back one to this folder okay sometimes you may go in and it's got a folder inside a folder okay so just keep going until you see these JSON files all right and then go back one like that okay so this is the folder I want and all I'm going to do is I'm going to click that and drag it over to community. That will then install. I can then start up Microsoft Flight Sim and select the aircraft I want. So the A330-300. I can then go to liveries and it should be in here, probably at the back because it's RAF. There we go. Right, Airbus MRTT. And there it is, the RAF livery for the A330. That's how you install a file of flightsim.to. Okay, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure you leave a comment uh, telling me so. And uh, don't forget to, to subscribe. Thanks, guys. If you enjoyed this clip, don't forget to follow or subscribe and leave a comment. Thanks.